Hello, uh, my name is Ron Smith, and um, I'd like to welcome you to the AEPS Preformulation 101 uh, e-course. Um, this is an introduction uh, to the program uh, with a focus on uh, the preformulation and biopharmaceutical considerations in the drug product design and development. Um, this introduction will be followed by nine other lectures that will go into the details of many of the preformulation concepts and biopharmaceutical principles that will be briefly introduced in the first lecture. So um, I'd like to begin with um, just sharing a bit of the outline and learning objectives of this lecture. Um, we will start with uh, a, a classic definition around preformulation and some of the, the concepts that are embedded within this part of the formulation continuum. We'll also look at what are the influences of preformulation as it uh, relates to the overall product development strategy and um, get into some of the interrelationships between key aspects of preformulation and biopharmaceutics, uh, most notably around solubility, permeability, and potency. Um, a central core to product development will involve how the API phase is discovered and evaluated, and then assessing the preformulation as part of um, lead candidate optimization. The role of the API in the overall form and function in formulation development, um, absorption modeling, simulation uh, will then lead us into concluding on how to integrate preformulation and biopharmaceutics in the rational design of products. So um, I'd like to begin with just that uh, definition. And in the very basic sense, the uh, the science of preformulation is really around studying the physical, chemical, and mechanical properties of drug substances, which can directly and indirectly influence the design, development, manufacture, and the bioperformance of a drug product. Some of the properties that are commonly evaluated and part of preformulation evaluation include solubility. And this will be a solubility in various media composition, pH, solvents, co-solvents. Um, dissolution of that API, again, in various media compositions. The physical and chemical stability of the drug substance. Some in intrinsic characteristics as it relates to lipophilicity, as well as charge, ionization constants. And then... Um, there's a series of solid state properties that are very central to uh, drug development. Um, and these take on certain areas of importance and greater emphasis depending on routes of administration. And although we will be focusing primarily on the oral route administration, preformulation is, 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 is core to any drug product development irrespective of route. So um, solid state properties around uh, the, the phase, crystalline, the polymorphs, the morphology, the size and shape of the particle, how it um, compacts as a tablet flows. Uh, these are all very um, key to um, predicting scale up uh, process and performance. Um, in many ways, the preformulation characterization that is done early in development provides that blueprint to rationally uh, develop formulations and drug products. And in many ways, the preformulation science, scientists can be viewed as that compositional architect to the formulation. 